Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what is most obviously very crucially important. Today on This Is Important... I sort of have to drink and then take z right before I go to bed in order just to sleep at night, so uh, keep them coming. I didn't know about Tucker, motherfucker. <laughs> and then there was the lasagna boys. Their dicks were shaped like lasagnas. <laughs> Were you gonna bring me that drink, or do we have to keep talking? Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh. (laughs) This week, let's have fun. Let's have fun this week. Oh my god. God. You guys want some cookies? Toasty, toasty, Mm -hmm. toasty. Blake, Ooh, keep uh, it going, dude. I'm These trying, are all dude. feeling really I don't nice. Give a fuck. Yes, boys. Wow. It's science. It's definitely yes. no for me, dog. I'm sorry, mama. What yep. your ass say? <laughs> this keep Zip it. Zip it. Yeah. 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 Fucking disaster, my guy. Do not come. Play the hits. Wheel. Keep playing the hits. <laughs> <laughs> Wheel. <laughs> I gotta hear that oh, one. That Larry one King. Wait, oh. <laughs> La- Larry <Wheel>. King. <laughs> Wheel. Uh-huh. That's what he, he said. So, guys, what is wheel? <laughs> and we're like, way <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> no. Oh, R.I.P. to the God. That was the best. I'm so glad that a, we did that interview. That dude, was such dude. a weird day. Uh, because yeah. it's Larry wheel. King. He was like 80 at the time. And we were interviewed by him. I don't really know why we were. but And then he asked us. He, was, he interviewed everybody. Yeah, but I feel like he didn't know who the fuck we were even a little bit. And it was kind of, I don't think he knew who a lot of people were. It was, it was hilarious that we were on there. Because his interns were kind of choosing. Was that his thing? Is he just didn't know anything about people? But like Odd Future, Odd Future got interviewed by them. Yeah. Yeah, he's just an old dude who loved to interview people and like get out of the house. Yeah, well, good, good on him. Once we were once we were invited, I think that's when he was kind of they were letting like the interns sort of like pick who was going on Larry yeah. King, yeah. Know, like the pe- kids with the ears. It, that no, it definitely felt like a like his young producers were were the ones steering the ship at that point. Where he's like, I don't give a shit. Let me let me just do a thing. I I went back for something else on my own, and it was just like, hey, and he was like. Nice to meet you. I'm like, uh huh. Right. And then of course on the car- on the well, cards sure. he's like, on the cards he's like, you've been here before. <laughs> You're like, are you asking? Yeah, no, I know. <laughs> I was playing. I was playing like I hadn't because you didn't remember me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I remember. It says on the cards. It says you were here before, and I remember that. Two thousand percent. Wheel. You're the wheel guy. Wheel. <laughs> Wheel. You were the wheel. <laughs> yes, Kyle. What were you gonna say? Kyle wanted to say something. I could tell. Well, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just curious. I was, I want to know like Wayo, like where that fucking came from. Cause like what, like the history of Wayo in the show. I remember it from some dumb like fucking wizards thing we did. Adam was like Wayo, like in the outtakes. Wayo. No, I know how it came into our lives. I believe. I think it was this fucking. Well, hit us with it, Jersey. I believe there was a certain executive at Comedy Central who mm. would show up into our writer's room saying it loudly, but it was like a right. thing. I don't know if oh, it was like a Jersey right. Shore thing uh, or like it was some show or wait, something. Oh, or, oh, so I we stole that. it from Jersey yeah. Shore? <laughs> yeah. Wheel. Whale's not ours. Hilarious. That makes it yeah. so much less cool. I don't know who it is, but he would come into the writer's room saying Whale. <laughs> <laughs> we borrowed we borrowed from Jersey or or is it cooler? Yeah, kind of yeah. lives up to the hype. Yeah, maybe we stole it from Snooky. Where are they? <laughs> Where's Snooky? I miss Dude, her. They're doing fine. Yeah, that's right. Where is Paulie D? Because he was the one that uh, the Jersey Shore guys that like was actually doing something outside of the the he was- show. Like he's like was yeah. a DJ and was making like a lot of money for a while. Yeah, I was at a Hard Rock hotel, and you know they've got all sorts of memorabilia on display, and it was like, it was like they're the best. Eddie Vedder's guitar, <laughs> fucking David Bowie's jumpsuit, yes. and then it was Pauly D's laptop. <laughs> he's the best. And I'm yeah. not joking at all. I was like, 
For sure, yeah. What? Like, what the fuck is? Like, what is going on? <laughs> well, also, like, you realize that, like, how many hard rocks there are. So yeah, or were at some point you're like they're running out of shit, right? Like cool <laughs> shit. Yeah. They're like, yeah, you're right. You're how? right. That's how. That's like why the laptop showed up in that one. <laughs> they're like, who can we get? And Pauly D's like, I'll give you my old laptop. And they're like, great, perfect. <laughs> It's not like there's not, it's not like they're opening at a like fucking Wheel. fast rate. <laughs> there's chill. There's, there's years and years there's, of music. Dudes, we get it. You love Polly D. And bands and, and musical acts every year. <laughs> every year. I'm just saying, <laughs> it's weird that he's got a laptop there. And you're saying like, well, they ran out of stuff. It's weird that they only had a laptop. <laughs> that they only had a laptop. They should have had more. They should have had more. I'm saying, why do you think they would be running out of, like, musical memorabilia? Well, how many well, hard rocks were there? There were a lot. There, I mean, I think there's a point. And when, at the height? Well, I'm saying of cool, of stuff. Let's say there's, let's say there's 200. 200. That's a lot. They have a lot. The bar is, the bar is high for what's on the wall. Like, this isn't. And then, and then it's, the walls are covered. I'm saying that, that they are digging in the crates for cool shit yeah. to put on their walls. And I bet Pauly D has a publicist or someone that was just like, we'll give you his laptop. And they're like, eh, uh, yeah, okay, we'll put it next to the men's restroom. Uh, like, we need something there. It, it had its <laughs> own, like, full, like, floor to ceiling case. What? With, like, I, well, a picture of him cool. behind it, like, headphoned <laughs> off. Unbelievable. It wasn't like just there. Dude, I mean, they were a true phenomenon. They really were. They were a true phenomenon. Look, yeah. wait, uh, I'll never yeah. should talk true, I mean, Snooki. insane. There, our producer Anna is saying that they're they're, they're back, back with a new season no. of their show and it's coming out soon, which Look. hilarious because they're older than us. So now they're all mid 40s, late 40s still doing the same shit and that's hilarious <laughs> i know it is <laughs> that shit's gtl right g <laughs> gtl is that that show the fucking yeah jim tan laundry jim tan dude laundry. Well, look was it laundry i could not remember what the fucking <laughs> l was <laughs> it's fucking long. yeah gtl jim tan laundry i i just want to get this out there i'm never gonna shit talk about snooki because snooki went on Monday Night Raw or one of those things <laughs> yes. and did a fucking backflip yes. off like yes. some oh, shit yes. and did some crazy wrestling moves and I was like, oh, she's about oh, she, yeah. You could tell she was like she was a high school cheerleader or For something. Sure. She was like the For little sure. tumbling yeah. queen. Yeah. Like the flyer. Yeah. Right? She, she seems like. Yeah, yeah, she went straight luchador yeah. on that shit. But she still had it. She was she was always doing like <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Respect. Well, when they when the, she was doing Respect. that show, she was in her twenties. That was a long time whoa, ago. Whoa, pow, whoa, pow. <laughs> like we'll see if she still has it when the show comes back out, coming oh, soon, yeah. Jersey Shore. Oh yeah, the new season. She's about to just do a back flip just to open the fucking credits. Can we name all these people? Yes, I can. Yeah, there's there's like a Vinny. I feel like okay. Blake said he can. Go ahead. Yes. Go ahead, Blake. <clears throat> Snooky. 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 Polly D. Yeah. Polly mm -hmm. D. Um, Mike, the situation. Oh, the situation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, Jay Wow. Jay yeah. Wow. Okay. Wow. Yeah. You're doing oh, good. Wow. Jay and Wow. Who's the other guy? Who's the, the real cock diesel dude? And there's one more. There's like that big thick. Yeah, the cock diesel. <laughs> <laughs> Is his name Vinny? Oh. Cock Diesel. That's his name. Cock Diesel. <laughs> his name was Cock Diesel. <laughs> I know it. Oh, I know it. <laughs> no, no, but I, d I know what it is. I just remembered it. You did? Oh, oh yeah. What is it? No, Blake knows them all. Um, what is it, Blake? Tell me when you don't have it, because I got it. It's not Cock Diesel. <laughs> I have a, I have a guess of what his first name is. <laughs> What's the guess? Because I'm, I'm floundering. Well, th that's all I have. I'm guessing Vinny, but I don't. <laughs> Vinny Bobber. No, not Vinny, but close, <laughs> close. Uh, oh, Vinny is a great <laughs> guess, Vinny. dude. That's a perfect guess. Thank you, thank you. T-shirt Alini. Uh, I got, I got it. Vinny Babazino. Uh, okay, Durst has it. Durst has it. It's not Mike. Ronnie. Ronnie. Yeah, oh. that's right. Ronnie's such a cool fucking name. 
<laughs> yeah, but that doesn't click at all for me, Ronnie. I, I, that, that. <laughs> <laughs> Ronnie was like the little diesel dude. That'd be really funny. They should have thrown in a guy who was completely different from all of them, just like Ronnie. And he just sort of right. like wore wore a suit and tie, went to work every day as a... Like that guy, 80 miles. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, guys. Yeah. Ronald. No, they, Jim Sant Laundry. No, they should have thrown... It should have been somebody that parties. I, <laughs> what they should have done is Durs, but yes. like early L.A. Durs, where he's yeah. wearing like two... Two Lacoste polos, popped collars. Were they not kind of popping collars? They're popping collars. They were. They were kind of collar poppers. Oh, were they? I thought they were shirtless and oiled. Yeah, they. No, they're they're <laughs> <laughs> shirts not allowed. I think that if they had on collars, they were popped. <laughs> yeah, if they were wearing collars, they were popping them. They were popped. Yeah. Okay, then yeah, you would have fit. You would have fit in then. Yeah. Were they wearing affliction? Is that are. Are they wearing affliction? But the affliction, but the hair situation was the crazy thing. The blooming onion joints. The gel. Real hard hair. Yeah. Real, real hard hair. They had they had the the uh <laughs> the blooming onion. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z going on for sure. For real. Yeah, they were they were bringing it. Are, did we get all the girls? Is that all the girls? J Wow, Snooky, and what was the situation? And Big Ange is Big Ange that show? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, there's one more girl. Big Ange. Because uh, it was three and three, right? I'm just naming people now. Yeah, there has to be another girl. Like maybe it's Rhonda. Ronnie and Rhonda or something. Yeah, there's one more. Ron, yeah. Right. Memorable. Uh, no. <laughs> I, I mean, someone could Google this quickly and find out for us. What is the name of that other girl? I can picture her. Sandy. We should not Google anything. <laughs> what does she look like? Tan. <laughs> Tan, dark hair. By the way, like, good for them. Anna, hit us with a hit us with a name in the chat. She definitely has dark hair. My guess is pretty Italian. Yeah. Pretty Italian uh, seeming. I I remember, it. dude. J Wow was a pull because uh, Italians Italians kind of went away for a little bit and then they brought them back. <laughs> they did. They did. Yeah, they did. They brought Italians back. <laughs> like Italian, it was kind hot, of- Hot, 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 hot! Well, Italians went away? Where'd they go? Yeah, you just didn't see much about Italians for a good five, seven years. They were bigger in like the 80s and 90s for sure. Yeah, Italians were huge in the 80s. <laughs> yeah, and then the 90s, yeah. They were. Man. Well, 70s too. Nin like mid to late 90s, you didn't really hear much about Italian people. 70s, yeah. dude. Italians were yeah. big in the 70s too. Hey, I'm glad. You're right. Bring back the ask? Yeah. What was that? <laughs> Let's bring back the ask. Okay, so that means that means our producers weren't <laughs> listening, and we asked. Oh, who's the third? F what is the, who is the name of the <laughs> other? The not J Wow, not Snooky, but the other girl from Jersey Shore. The show that we're talking about, <laughs> Jersey Shore. Sammy, <laughs> the name? Sammy Sweetheart. Sammy Sweetheart. That doesn't ring a bell. S Sammy Sweetheart. <laughs> Sammy Sweetheart. No. Well, neither does Ronnie. So, so. <laughs> I mean, you are you bummed if you're Sammy Sweetheart yeah, and damn. like no <laughs> one remembers you? No, you might actually be stoked about that. Ange. Yeah, I knew there was an Ange. Was an Angela Pavarnik. Pa oh, so her name is Angela Pavarnik. Wait, who's that? Sammy Sweetheart is Angela Pavarnik. 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 No. There's four. There's four women. There's four women. Angela was kicked off and allowed back. Oh, so it was kicked off and allowed back. Oh, damn. That's always the best. Can we see a picture of Ronnie, possibly? Dina Nicole. Oh, there's another one? Dina, Dina Nicole? Dina, now you guys are just throwing names. <laughs> now you're just making stuff up. Dina Nicole, how many people How many people were on the Jersey Shore? <laughs> yeah, there seems to be like a, the three guys, and then they might have had a few different rotating women. Hello. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> yeah. Now everybody sh is chiming in. There's there's like six different people. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah. The, 
<laughs> this is the effect. I've never seen the producer chat go off like this. This is fucking firing, bro. My God. Yeah, every everybody's chiming in. Yeah, Diener was brought on later, and she was part of the meatball crew with Snooky. Snooky was part of a meatball crew? What was that about? What's the meatball crew? Well, because she was like a shaped like a little meatball. <laughs> they no. little round like a little meatball. No, that's that's really? No. <laughs> Is it? And they're Italian, right? No, I, don't I know. mean, it's the Jersey Shore. It's very possible. And then there was the lasagna boys. Their dicks were shaped like lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> no, because they were like meat, like yeah. beefy dudes. Oh, okay. yeah, that makes more sense. Yeah. That makes okay. more sense. All right, cool. Damn. Well, shit. I'm and they're back. You're saying they're back? <laughs> what is it? Is it okay? So yeah, they're back and their parents <laughs> on what Paramount Plus? Yeah. Where they're coming back and Ronnie Ortez Magro, which is his name, is one year sober in Jersey Shore's return. So he's he's sober. He's gone sober. Oh, oh, you're there's going to be a sober. There's going to be a sober him. perspective uh, for the past year. And now he's going back on the reality show. That might be a real a real test for him. Yeah, that could be a trigger. That's going to be a yeah. recipe for disaster. That's going to be a pull. Where he, the whole time he's just like, that's a bad decision. That's going to be a plot line. That's a <laughs> big mean- <laughs> plot line, baby. Yeah, I'm seeing dollar signs. Yep. You know these reality guys. They'll exploit that shit. What was the first of those... What was the first of those VH1 reality shows where they put all the celebrities together? And it was like... Oh, like celebrity rehab? It was like Ron Jeremy and the guy from Perfect Strangers. And they and, were all uh, like measuring dicks together. And <laughs> Mini Me like died. Vern. Vern Troyer, RIP. Know what I mean? We're going right past that? Wait, no. I, no, what, what, what is that, Durs? What was that show? What was that era? And like they would all have to speak... Was that the same one where they'd have to speak with... Is it Celebrity House? Dr. Drew? Or- it was called Celebrity Rehab House or something. I thought it was Celebrity Rehab. Yeah, I thought that's... And right. then, yeah, Dr. Surreal House. Surreal House? Surreal House. Allegedly! Did- reality TV used to be, like, no holds barred. Actually real. Like, actually real. <laughs> I know. Well, I think it's probably... Well, produced. I think it's probably coming back if the writer's strike happens. Uh-oh. Hollywood Minute. Hollywood Minute. Hollywood Minute, ladies and gentlemen. Hollywood Minute. <laughs> Which they say it might in a few in a few months. <laughs> it, Hollywood like- Minute. Uh... This is important, Hollywood Minute. <laughs> if the writer's strike happens, which they think it might in a few months, mm-hmm. then the reality TV will be ushered back in because Usher. they technically don't have writers. Mm-hmm. Uh, and yes, sir. Well, it's not like reality TV has gone anywhere. I'm saying like reality TV used to be like flagrant and dangerous. Like. Well, I feel like it has gone away. Like it you, and now, it's just like The Bachelor and like the big, the big hitters. And now it's like more like game shows, The Masked Singer, or like variety shows, stuff That's like just, that. But sure, w- there was a time when like there was a million reality shows, like Surreal House and Celebrity Rehab and Big Brothers, and yeah, but those are all still on. Big Brothers still on. It is. Yeah, is it's it? in like season 52. Yeah, but like, isn't like the Kardashians, is the Kardashians a reality show? That's a reality show, right? Yeah, yeah. But it's like, mm-hmm. yes, that's a reality show. Yes, very much so. Adam, are you saying just like reality competition? Because there's many genres. <laughs> yeah, um, it has spiked it's into some, it's splintered. It has splintered. <laughs> I'm just talking about the ones that seem like it's icky. The ones that seem icky are seem to be gone. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. And I want those motherfuckers back. Like Jerry, like Jerry Springer. Well, you want, so you want you want old school Jerry Springer back. I want like no. who wants to marry a millionaire when you meet him for like ten seconds, Wheel. right? Yeah. Oh, um, right. I want like giraffe versus shark. I want all the crazy shit. You want whale? The reality show. Wheel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> well, I think that yeah, also, we've, there's oh. like, we found out that those types of reality shows are actually super damaging to like the human psyche. Like, the Osborne For family sure. went off the fucking side of a cliff after that. But do you think that has stopped the demand for it? Did they? I feel like she's super. Did, what? Wait, off the cliff? She's fine, but the kids went kind of haywire after that. Isn't the other one? Well, yeah. I mean, you do a reality show with any family. I mean, same thing happened with Hogan. It and with young people involved, they can't. There it is. Yeah, they can't handle it. That being said, Blake, 
it's not like everyone got a conscious and is like <laughs> conscience. Who cares? Is like, uh, <laughs> <Me either. laughs> I got myself. Jiminy Cricket, baby. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, and suddenly are like, well, now we can't do that because these families are going to go off a cliff. <laughs> yeah, that's true. No, that's what I mean. Like we didn't exactly. We're, there's no there's no morals in this. You know, it's no, but Instagram happened. No, Instagram oh. happened and people are doing it their own and they're not like waiting for someone to put them on. They're just like, yo. That's true. And now and now kids are doing like the Hype House and like David Dobrik and all those kids are like just doing their own thing on YouTube and essentially they're doing reality shows of them and their yeah, friends. Yeah, people can go live now. They have the camera in their hand. That's that's as much reality TV as that. Hang on a second. Catch me up on this concept. What are we saying? <laughs> it's called going. What are you saying? They got a whole. They got a TV <laughs> antenna in their pocket. What are yeah, we explain uh, to what? old man Anders? <laughs> Tech going, talk. What are you saying? What's do they? Everyone's got their own call sign now. What, <laughs> WTT? What WTF? Uh, what are we talking goodbye. about? Uh, <laughs> dude, yeah, man, it's crazy world out there. Huh. Well, dude, speaking of <laughs> like, uh, like. <laughs> Being so connected, it was so. I just got back from Indonesia. Yes. Of being so connected. Yeah. And I went on a trip where there was 15 of us. Segway. Yes. And and we, I, it was the first t time in my life that I absolutely couldn't get cell reception mm. for like a week straight. Congrats, right. There was man. nothing you could do to get it. That's got to be weird. Yeah. It was, it was actually like really kind of cool and very weird. Yeah. I dig that. And it was like a full on week of like, just not getting any. And like, I kept my phone on and then it'd be like in the middle of the night, I would get like 23 texts. Like mm -hmm. we were, we went through a passage right. somewhere that some, a satellite was pointing at and I was able to get these text messages. Did but you get my nudes? <laughs> Indonesia is like maybe the prettiest place i mean for sure the prettiest place i've ever been but kind of the sad part uh -oh. is uh oh <laughs> there's like uh okay okay no there's like a lot of trash like there's a lot of like plastic yeah. and i've never been like the type of guy who gives a fuck <laughs> like that would like see a <laughs> plastic bottle and be like fuck right uh, like i recycle like a regular person mm -hmm. but i'm like not that crazy about it well let's get into it how do you recycle <laughs> right. how regular is it and now i'm like fuck i like need to get all the plastic out to uh out of my life i'm like i need to be like one of those guys that carries around like a metal canister of his yeah. water because right and a glass straw. It was crazy some of these like bottles that you would find you're like my god this is years old like this is forever <laughs> old and it's just washing <laughs> itself so and it's just how the current world it. makes like, a little it trash it all collects on this one spot and you're like fuck that sucks because it's so beautiful here we were all like wow <laughs> dude Adam was my god this is <laughs> Adam was about to make a, a stance. He was about to flex his power, his mission statement, and he froze. That's big plastic that wow. froze him before he could talk right. about it. Shit, man. Dude, that's a wild. I was going to ask, like, did he recognize anything out there? Like, that's mine. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm chunking. <laughs> yeah, what the freaking heck, dude? But uh, I guess I have to save that joke. My chunking? Dude, oh, there he's are. back. Oh, he's you're back. back. He's you're back. back. <laughs> Adam dude, is you perfect froze. timing. Uh, dude, I like I was I was teeing off on like how I need to like be more socially responsible when it comes to the recycling. And then you guys all had the uh, most like disgusted looks on your face. So I'm like, okay, okay, yeah. I mean, yeah. Right. Fuck that. It's not real. Yeah. Fuck recycling. <laughs> It doesn't work. <laughs> yeah. I was kidding. I don't recycle. But it truly was the, the prettiest place yeah. I've, I've ever been. It really was. A Adam, did, did you just see like lots of like um, plastic uh, barges like out in the water? Is that what you're talking about? Like you just saw these plastic. Plastic barges. Like collections no, it'd be like, of like we, fucking uh, or like what? We would like go. We would go to like these. Uh, it was so pretty and we were away from. There wasn't a single other. There was like another boat that was we were kind of on the same journey mm -hmm. together. That's cute. And so we would see this other boat every every mm -hmm. day or two. But like really there was no other people. We didn't run into any locals. We wow. and you would you, you'd be like, "Hey, can we go kick it uh so we were on like a yacht and we were like, "Can we go kick it on this beach over here?" Mm -hmm. And they're like, "Yeah." And they'd go and the the people that were working on the yacht would like go and put up umbrellas and like and we'd go over there and it's beautiful. And then you kind of go around the corner and you see like where all the water pushes 
and there'd just be like yeah. certain spots where the it would just collect all the just right. for how the current moves and right. there just it'd just be like a little trash island over there and you're like fuck man this sucks and right around the corner it's pristine and it's beautiful right but mm. then just like right around the river bend the river bend well, <laughs> this is what pocahontas was about yeah. dude that's yeah. crazy yeah. it's cool you guys did your part though and you you cleaned up. Clean. You cleaned it up. Yeah. Yeah. You grabbed you it. You got and, out there. Yeah. Obviously. Uh, no, we did. We we like Chloe and I were like, well, do you have a fucking bag? We can pick some shit up. But there was like no. There was a. He's like, yeah. There's a bag over here. <laughs> throw the ba <laughs> throw a bag in there, man. <laughs> we got a bunch of bags. Yeah. There's a, here's a bag. There's, there's tons of bags right over there. Yeah, plastic bags. Just, Take oh that God. bag. Filled with other plastics. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, there was no making a dent in it. It was like, and it, it, you would pick something up and it'd be like, yeah, don't even try. Everything's like kind of congealed together. <laughs> oh, and you're God, like, yeah. oh, shit. Now it's just yeah. one giant piece of plastic. Yeah, yeah it's impossible. Why, why, why even? <laughs> you got to burn it. <laughs> Fucks. Don't even take a step. Yeah, don't even step towards it. <laughs> Send it to space. But besides that, like it was, it, it was like, the prettiest place. I went scuba diving every day. Yeah. Oh, uh, damn. And like the, the coolest cute. scuba diving fucking ever. I mean, and there were sharks everywhere, which is cool since we did the. Uh, wow. Okay. We're kind of your scuba buddies, but okay. <laughs> well, since we did Shark Week together, like yeah, it was cool hell? to have like absolutely no fear of the sharks. And all the other people were diving were like, right. oh, sharks. I'm like, it's fine. Acting like some bitches. You're like, yeah, this like, thing biting me does not <laughs> matter. Shit. This, this, this guy? <laughs> with What kind of sharks are we talking about? What what kind of stuff are we seeing under there? It, well, they weren't too, too gnarly. It was like just like black tip, reef. Uh, like reef sharks. And mm. yeah, so mm -hmm. it wasn't too. Did you say the sharks had bleach tips? Yeah, dude, bleach tips. <laughs> <bleach, laughs> uh, yeah, they're from fucking... Blake's favorite decade, the 90s. Bro, bro, was... bro they had bleach tips yeah. out there underwater? <laughs> when it's the shark smiled and had no teeth and then showed his necklace was all his teeth. Yeah, bro. <laughs> you kidding me? It was um, Snooky, Snooky the shark, baby. Adam, uh, I'm glad you didn't drown, because if you drown caught in one of those little plastic six-pack ringlets. <laughs> that oh. would have been the worst way to go. Fucking that sucks. We would have to do a PSA. That would have been the worst way to go. But it it did make me go like, man, I hope like I can <laughs> still I hope I continue to work for another ten years because I'd like to be able to afford to go on trips like this, like myself with my friends. You yeah. know, like I, I was almost positive you were gonna circle back to some sort of cause <laughs> I know, I thought so too, that it's like I no, wanna be no, able dude. to make a dent on these you were like, it really kind of struck me, and I, yeah. I want to keep working so I have a platform where I can speak. <laughs> nope. Yeah. Wheel. Yeah. Trips on yachts around the world well, for that, sure. No, no, no. I'll, I'll go pick up. I'll go pick up some <laughs> shit on the beach every once in a while. Hold up. <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, with you. Loose I hope. Butthole. I hope so too. But because uh, it was the best, dude. I'm like, my god, that's the perfect way to vacation. I totally get it. It's like, yeah. Well, you. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Well, yeah. That's I. I mean, <laughs> there's yeah. There's no debate. That's like a dream. Like, yes. <laughs> it's gotta be. I mean, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I guess I, I didn't know that it was my dream. Like, <laughs> I, I figured like I want to go explore. I want to go to different cities and like go to different places. But I'm like, no, it turns out I don't. I don't want it to be hectic. I just want to wake up and be in a beautiful place and then just sort of lounge around, have people bring me food and then go swimming and go diving. That's life. Well, you didn't know. Wait, yeah. man of the people. I love this guy. Yeah. Wait, you didn't Relatable. know that this was your dream? You had Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that, dude. I thought I thought I wanted to go mix it up and and you get had out there, but nah, dude, I don't. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> hey, they swung you. <laughs> yeah, man, I got to see your Instagram discoveries page. They swung me, man. They they won me over. <laughs> they they swung me, dude. Twist uh, my swung you. you got my vote, guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm team billionaire now. <laughs> Turns out I love <laughs> my own personal yacht. People serving me, setting me up umbrellas. I love Something it. about it. Something <laughs> about it. I'm dude, in, brother. I did. <laughs> hey, you're twisting my Call arm. Call me crazy. I did. I didn't know how I was going to feel about people waiting on me hand and foot. Yeah. Turns out, love it. It was great. Turns out.
It's cool. And I hope I just keep working so they can keep hooking me up. <laughs> it's cool, dude. If there's no garbage can, you just chuck it overboard. It collects all together. It can yeah, it <laughs> It'll congeal over there on that island. It's Sweet all Jackson. good. Somebody's going to get it. It's all Gucci. That's dope. So how many days? So did you, you never, <laughs> you didn't go to land. You didn't go no. like, check out uh No locals. The is. Yeah. No, to, never, uh, never went anywhere. Like, the, the staff were they were all local and you know you talk to them about like what it's like living in Indonesia but we never went to like a Mount, don't look me in the eyes <laughs> not too long though of course <laughs> yeah, no obviously uh, were you gonna bring me that drink or do we have uh, to keep talking <laughs> <laughs> no but what's funny is like in Indonesian culture uh, they're Muslim um, a Muslim and they like didn't they mostly some aren't mostly yeah and they like didn't drink like yeah. so, no. So like, mm. you felt like a real alcoholic when you're like, <laughs> right. uh, you're, you're, you're like, can I get another? And they're like, another. And you're like, really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. You know. Uh, yeah. Don't be weird about it. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of gonna do this until I go to bed. Yeah, I'm gonna keep having these. And um, they're like, really? You want any water? <laughs> you're like, you don't understand yeah. the nightmares, the uh, like childhood. Yeah. You know. I sort of have to drink and then take <laughs> Zequil right before I go to bed in order just to sleep at night. So uh, <laughs> keep it right. coming. What was the show? The this is the show way. where. Um, Anne Hathaway and what's the homeboy's name? Fucking actor dude who we were talking actor about his dude. dick on like the second episode. Mm, Kenny Tatum. Dicks. Uh, Pete Davidson. Kenny uh, Tatum. Uh, Jared Leto. Uh, Jared, Jared Leto. Leto. Jared, Jared Leto. Leto. Jared what, Leto. really? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Great, yeah. Um, he like. <laughs> who cares? The Sorry. like, the housekeeper comes in to wake him up and like lights a bong for him as he like rolls out of bed and he hits it. Oh shit. Who is that? You guys gotta watch the WeWork show. It was it was pretty good. Oh, it's called We Crashed on we Apple crashed. TV. Uh, yeah. th man, yeah. they sure did make a lot of those like startup shows. Like I watched the Uber show, and then the I missed that one. How was that? What is that? Th it was called. It was uh, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, and it was uh, on Showtime, oh. and mm. it was fine. It was fine. But yeah. I'm like, mm. I sort of was just like, what, what, what is it about the upstart? It's about the upstart of Uber. And mm. dude, and I dude. sort of was like... Kyle's like, never heard of it. <laughs> no, this shit's so whack, dude. It's like I heard they're doing the same... I sort of was like, who gives a shit? Yeah, yeah. This, I heard about this with the Beanie Babies, and I'm like, who gives a fuck about the inner workings of the... Right. Ad Adam's mad now. Adam's like, well, actually... <laughs> no, but honestly, like, who cares honestly. about the inner working? I'm kind of thinking that when I'm watching Chippendales. I'm like, who fucking cares? What do you mean? <laughs> but that, that to me, it's, at least it seems like there was a cool story with the Chippendales. Chippendales guy like doesn't he kill someone or he did he like went crazy well I don't know I haven't got to the end of it because I really lost me like I'm like eh it just yeah. kind of yeah. is like uh, whatever is this a gay stuff dude yeah so like <laughs> the uber one was like he was kind of misogynistic uh huh misogynistic right. people who the, the uber guy right the uber guy yeah. And that was like the stiff. Uh, I think I didn't finish it so maybe it gets better but uh, <laughs> I just was like he's not that's what I mean both of you guys. He got ousted. He got ousted. None of this shit fucking is good. He's He wasn't like a total monster, and it didn't seem like it was that bad. It didn't seem like he was deserving of a whole show. Like, something needs to happen. Allegedly! <laughs> like, something needs to happen in order to give this a show. No, I know. That's what I was saying the other day. I feel like, like these miniseries are just like... He should have murdered someone. These miniseries are just hitting tropes, okay. and they're not really, they're taking IP, and then they're hitting tropes, and they're giving actors a great platform to do a fucking sick-ass performance uh -huh. every episode, yeah. but the storytelling is wackadoodle, well, and I don't care. If you start, if you have a startup, and you want a spinoff show... Yes, he comes back from Italy. <laughs> if you want a spinoff show, <laughs> yeah. uh, yeah. Yeah. Italian. Listen to me. <laughs> what you have to do is you have to murder someone. Yeah. Well, you okay. have to murder Are someone. these shows at least informative? Like, why are you even pushing play then if you don't care about the story of Uber or Chippendale? Well, I didn't know. I didn't know. I was just, I was fucking, I was bored and was just like. Blake, Blake, relax. Well, yeah. I'm not going to push play well, on the Uber show. I'm going to tell you that right now. You got to watch the WeWork one. It's what? good. <laughs>
Why? What is so good? It's like he wakes up and smokes weed. Like I, I do that some days. Me, t- I do that Give every fucking show. day, dude. <laughs> every day. A- yeah, yeah. Fucking. I don't need to watch a show about a guy doing that. Within 15 minutes, I'm fucking hitting that weed, baby. He has someone who does that for him. He like Smoke puts his weed mouth every day. up and they light it and he hits it. That's one part of the show. The reason to watch it is Anne Hathaway and Jared Leto are like next level. Yeah. Well, exactly. They're performance vehicles. I can't yeah. deny that. These I'm... actors get juice every fucking scene. Wait, so shows are performance vehicles? Sure. I like Anne Hathaway. Is 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 Jared Leto good? Yeah, he's he's amazing. Yeah, uh, that guy puts in some work. I'm nah. confused as to, I, I don't know. I feel like you could say this about any show. Like, why am I watching it? I mean, it's just a, it's an informative story. Why? Are you- I know the problem is, is like if you wow, dude. And Blake, when you get dark like and deep like <laughs> <No>. that, bro. <laughs> Deep and dark. Here we go. The thing is, is like deep and dark, dark and stormy. <laughs> like, what do you want? You want Jared, Jared from Subway Story? You want to go dark? Honestly, hey, <laughs> yeah, I would. That would be a better story, dude. Yeah. If you took the Uber off off the title, took the chase of the IP out there, sure. it would force the story. It's not called Uber. It's not called the Uber story. It's it's called Taxi. If you took the fucking IP out of it, you would force the. No, it's not. It's called it's called Super Pumped. No, but Taxi was a show about people driving people around. That wasn't... We've been over this. Blake needs shows that have what it is in the title. Oh, so. sure. Okay. <laughs> right, right, right. Plane. Is this thing on? Sure. <laughs> I just think they're sure. like, oh, it's going to be an Uber show. People will click because it's Uber. And I, then they've, Wait. the storytelling just fucking falls. It's just not good. What part of saying the name Uber makes me go, ooh, Uber, I've taken that. I, I want to I wanna know the story of Uber. That doesn't... Ooh. Bl- like, Blake, that's exactly what it is. Ooh, I task rabbit. I've got to tune in. <laughs> <laughs> Craigslist. I fucking think this shit is so stupid that there's a show that exists like that because it clogs the airwaves for an original piece that could be like... Much but, more but, fucking interesting and dynamic. So wait, where does that where does that line stop for you? Did like so like the nine eleven movie United nine three or whatever? Yeah, is that stupid to you? Yeah, huh? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, is that what you're saying, Kyle? <laughs> well, no that that is a very is it real? Was nine eleven real? Is gorilla is gorillas in the mist? Weird? Yeah. What about Tucker, a man in his dream? That's a very heroic story. Those are. Aren't those heroic stories? Those are heroic stories. Tucker was an unsung company. You didn't know about Tucker. Hey, also, guys, 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 guys. <laughs> you didn't know about Tucker. <laughs> you uh, Tucker, mother. It does. You didn't know about Tucker, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> the reason I brought up Super Pumped, the battle for Uber. The battle for Uber. It's in the title. It's. I guess it is in the title. Okay. Uh, the reason I brought it up, suck a was it's. It just there was nothing to it. Like, I understand if if 9-11 or something where there's like it actually something happens that you can build a show around a traumatic mm-hmm. event or like Murder. even the <laughs> or, yes. or even in the Chippendales where I I'm pretty sure he murders people at some point. Well, there's like there's some shit that goes on the first couple episodes that I've seen, but then it just aye, becomes aye, aye. like, what is this? So I'll yeah. finish it. Just naked dudes, bro. I'm not trying to watch that. And so <laughs> the rescue rangers do or don't solve the murder? Yeah, what's going on with the with Chip and Dale? The Chip and Dale's rescue rangers. Is Monterey Jack in it? Yes, points! I, I guess it's just, it's just his feeling. What's the name of the little fly? Zip. Zipper? It's just feeling like fuck that shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's just feeling like fuck yeah. that shit. I can't Dude, really... And I love when you get dark and, and stormy. Yeah, and really gnar and yeah. dark and deep. I think it's just clogging the airwaves is what I don't like about I... it. It's like just trash clogging the airwaves. But it's the... it's the the, the the Kyle, I mean, I we're, we're just going to say stuff we all know. It's just yeah. familiarity. Well, it's just right. because if somebody made up a movie about a company, everyone would be, the way we would pitch it. But that wouldn't get greenlit. I know. But what I'm saying is the way you would pitch it anyway is you would go, imagine a company like Uber. And then they would go, why don't you just make the one called Uber? So everyone who goes, hey, what's on tonight? Hey, there's a sh- show about making Uber. They go, I know what that is, as opposed but to, th- it's a movie about a company kind of like Uber well, called. Well, I get it. And you would think, I'm so confused. You would think a juggernaut would go like if we were like and we have this hit show seven seasons and we're doing this movie they would agree. 
Chuck they e. were greenlining it. If they did the super pump the battle for Uber, you would think. Is it international? Yeah, that's true. I want. Yeah, yeah. Is it? It's yeah, just big in Australia. <laughs> is it global enough? Does it? Oh, uh, I started watching Tulsa King. Did you guys start watching Tulsa King? <laughs> yeah, legit, not good. And I oh. wanted to love it. <laughs> I wanted to really like it, dude. I watched. I couldn't sleep last night. I, and I watched the whole thing. I watched all of it because I was like, "Oh wow!" Because I commit to bad stuff. I, you know, I, I, I'll just, I'll just double down on it and, and watch right. the whole damn thing. And Ew. it just doesn't get much better. And you're just sort of like, yeah. And Adam, what was your take on Banshees of Inisherin? <laughs> I, did, I didn't watch it. I did watch. I really want to see that. Uh, last night I watched uh, All Quiet on the Western Front, and oh my god, it's good. It's oh really- yeah, that's good shit. Is it really that quiet, or who's in it's it? Way loud. It's, uh, yeah, it's sort actually. Of- it's super this- loud on the Western Front. There's like bombs and shit. Yeah, it's a German movie. Well, they spend that part in the second act on the Eastern Front. That was a good departure. Yeah, was- yeah. Uh, very good. Yeah, it also it made me like refresh my memes on what the fuck happened in World War One. I'm like, what happened in World War One? What do you mean refresh your memory? I never knew. Well, I feel like I knew. Like I passed history class. Like I must have known what the fuck was going on. It was the Ottoman Empire. Yeah, um, that's right. Uh, I know no. more about, was about World War II than World War One. Well, sh- for sure. Because World, War- yeah. World War II was, like, actually about shit. Right. World War I One was just, like, it was like a, a land battles. Mm. It's like battle over land. Yeah. World War One. No, I thought that was, isn't that where, like, it wasn't like Franz Ferdinand got, like, murdered, and then, like, we went to war over that, like, Austria- Hungry and shit. The, the band? Cool band. But what yeah. the fuck? Were we involved in that? Was America in World War One? Yes. Was America? Yeah. Uh, yeah. And we came in way later. Oh, yeah. so we weren't. Okay, okay. Late to the party. <laughs> we were late to the All party. Right. And then when we came, we just fucking roll, fools, dog. Oh, sick, dude. World War champion two time back to back. Is that where G.I. Joe came from? Aye, aye, aye. Is that where what came from? Is that where G.I. Joe came from? World War One. Must be um, the cartoon from the eighties. I don't. The, think no, I think it was a toy the, first. Oh yeah, it was. It was like a Barbie doll. It's possible. No, it was a GI Joe, homie. It wasn't a Barbie doll. What the fuck, Blake? Dude, where was where was Destro? Yeah. <laughs> no, you're done. You're go. You can leave. You can go. Where was Destro in World War One? <laughs> <laughs> but it's a really good movie. If you haven't seen it, it's on Netflix. All Quiet on the Western Front, and and I guess they've made. I guess it was a huge book. And then this is like the fourth time they've made the movie. So, uh, well, I've seen the original, or I don't like the the one from way back. Way back. Um, <laughs> I didn't know it was from way back. I yeah. I thought it was like a. I was like, oh, that's a that's a good title. I feel like I've heard that somewhere. Yeah. And then I feel like um, it's. And then it's it, obviously they've done it four other times. I gotta mm. see that. That's crazy that they were like, "Hey, that movie everyone loves that I think is like one of like the AFI top hundred movies and all that. Mm-hmm. Let's remake that." <laughs> yeah. Hey, real dice roll. And what's kind of crazy you know. is it's in German, but they dub it in <laughs> English for us. So like, oh. it doesn't quite match up. Mm. And it. At first, you're like, oh, this is going to bug me. I'd rather just read subtitles. You can, I think you can do that on your, like in your dials of your Netflix or whatever it was on. I think so. Remember, uh, what was that really popular show where it was like the game show and everybody's dying, the Korean Squid show? Squid Game? Yes. Yeah, Squid Game. The, that, when it was um, dubbed, was terrible. I had to just read mm-hmm. subtitles. I preferred the subtitles. The, the dub yeah. acting was bad, yeah. bad stuff. I yeah, believe you. Yeah. And I, mm, I kind of, I got used to it. Like at first, I'm like, it's gonna bother me, and then, and then I was, then it didn't, and then it didn't. Uh, oh, it was just like Samurai Sunday <laughs> for you. And then I didn't have to read. And then I didn't have to read. <laughs> also, I for whatever titles, go ahead, Kyle. Oh. Kyle, no, 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 go ahead. Kyle, you have the no, floor. Kyle, no, Kyle, Kyle, you have no, the floor. Kyle. What are you gonna say about Chip and Dale? Dude, no, dude man, we know no, you don't no, like naked just... guys. All right, you made your point. No, I told you I like that part. <laughs> that part was tight. What do you got, Kyle? What do you got? I was baby? just saying, is there's a difference in my mind between like a remake and an IP grab for whatever reason. Like, there's a major difference. You know like, that they're both IP, though, right? I do know that, but yeah. What does that mean? Like a a remake is a remake of 
intellectual property from everybody for everybody at home who doesn't give a fuck about this. Right. So like I know that Fast and Furious was a, was Ouch. a remake. That's really yeah. That's from like the 30s. They Sorry, made that movie. Is it a remake or is it just a title reuse? It's title. It's yeah. It's a title reuse. It's a way different movie. It wasn't a remake. Well, they're always going to be a reinterpretation, though, right? It's always going to be that. people. Yeah, that's been going on since plays, where it's like, this person directs this play, and there's an interpretation of that. Right, but they're still the same no. script. They're, they go off the same script, though, pal. I think you can take liberties, though, can't you? I know, but what you're saying is that Fast and Furious was a remake of a movie, right? and it's like, was it a remake? Or they were like, good title, let's use the title again and make a totally new movie. Right. And nobody knew yeah, the title right. when they remade it. So they were like, we have this piece of gold that we can take. So it really didn't help anybody go to the theaters. Well, and also Fast Furious was a bad, uh, well, the, it was sort of a remake because it was point break, like beat for beat. Right. Yes. Which is fine because it completely switched the backdrop, a whole new world, which, you know. A whole new world. Yeah. Like if you wanted to do like a remake of The Fugitive or something like it that. It would have been great. <laughs> Make it, it totally different. Great. So like, you know. That'd be, that'd be amazing. The Fugitive that is one of my gosh. favorite movies. It's not like a, a wife doesn't get killed. Maybe like a drug dealer gets put in a coma sure. and three sure. friends go to jail yeah. and, and have to get out. I mean, yeah. That, yeah, I'm listening. I'm watching. That'd be awesome. That would be a really fun movie. That'd yeah, be a right. really fun movie. That That's a nice be. little lateral. Swap Harrison Ford for the Three Stooges and we're good. Yeah, That's so awesome. just good. to give uh, fans some uh, <laughs> update on the movie, uh, still not happening. So, no update. Right. Yeah. <laughs> So no no update. Uh, yeah, yeah nothing, nothing, hell, nothing really yeah. to say uh, except for uh, we're still buttered about we're, it, and we're still gonna send it. <laughs> and uh, we're poking around Paramount Plus <laughs> to see what kind of content they got. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Tulsa we'll remake King. Tulsa King. Yeah, Let's make be it pro. Sly is seventy five. Let's make a movie about the um. The guy who the guy who created Dave and Buster's that would be pretty freaking sick. R.I.P. By the way, did he murder some people or? <laughs> well, he just passed away, so we could maybe sniff around and find out why. Natural natural causes. <laughs> <laughs> Old. Uh, yeah, he ate too many fucking chicken wings, man. Yeah. For sure. I don't know. I just like. I think as the four of us, Dave and Buster's, it just makes sense, dude. Well, we had, what do we have? Snap, Crackle, Pop? Weren't you guys? Well, there's only the four of us, and that, those are two names. It's actually one guy named Dave and <laughs> Dave, Dave and Buster. His last name is Buster's. It, yes. <laughs> Dave, Dave and Buster's. <laughs> dude, when's the last time you guys been to a Dave and Buster's? Because those plays freaking rock, mm. dude. Too long. Is that how we all get together? We all <laughs> hit up the Hollywood Dave and Buster's? Uh, I would like that. Oh, for maybe we had the one out in Arcadia, guys. I don't know. Oh yeah, let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got drive way out to you. Kyle, I've been to that you, one. Kyle, would yeah. you show up for that? Would you pull up to it a- for Arcadia? Yeah, man, I'll roll to Arcadia. Oh, uh, also, uh, we can go to let's let's haul ass out to Catalina. That'd be fun. Ooh, do a channel. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, that's a good idea. I don't like that. Maybe. Yeah, let's let's do a little day trip. Oh, let's do a little. Switch channels, little little channel change. I like that. Yes, punch. Oh, channel hop. As long what as there's um, no. little there, Coco <laughs> Chanel. Is there any takebacks, apologies, any epic slams? Hmm. When does this show come out? When when does this episode drop? Do we know what day? Sixty nine. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we're, we're two weeks out. Is this so. the Oscars? Is this the Oscars? When are the Oscars? Oh, February 6th. February 6th. Oh, congratulations. Everything, everywhere, all at once. Oh, you're calling it. <laughs> yeah, you're calling fuck it. yeah, dude. I like that. Okay. I think they'll okay, take. Okay. I think they'll take song. I think the Daniels have a chance of taking director. Well, it'd be the seventh. Yeah, the seventh Tuesday. What song? The I love Sun Lux. Sun Lux made all the music for that movie, and I just I hope he does. I just don't even know the song though. I don't know the name of it either, but. <laughs> The band composed the movie, and they rock. What is the movie called? Every Everything, Everywhere, All at Once. Is that right, Kyle? Yeah. Everything. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Did you uh, never see it, Adam? No, I, I, I just watched it on a plane. The plane mm-hmm. from Indonesia, dude, it took four. You saw a little bit of some of it all in pieces? All okay. in pieces. No, I saw, <laughs> I saw it all. But, <laughs> it, dude, it's four, four yes, flights, points. and it takes over 24 hours to get there. It's a true haul. But... Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, I watched it, but I was like, uh, 
I, I was like half paying attention. I feel like I I, sh I need to rewatch yeah. and like really invest. That movie is a fucking fever dream, dude. Yeah, yeah. Because the internet was on and popping. Uh, Singapore Airlines, their internet works great. I'm like, oh shit, this is way better than Delta. Like their fucking shit sucks. Uh -huh. uh, like Singapore <laughs> Airlines, my god, they're it's on fire this Wi-Fi. So I was just like cruising Twitter, my favorite app, and uh, yeah. Hey, I love Singapore Airlines too. Let me get a voucher. Yeah, let's get some vouchers, baby. Fuck it. Um. So yeah, I wasn't paying a close enough attention. Every time I looked up, it was so insane and wild that I was like, mm -hmm. "Ah, fuck!" I like totally. I have no idea what the fuck is happening. Dude, yeah, you that, gotta really watch that one. I can tell you, Blake. Blake, will you tell me what it is? It, it hold is, on, uh, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I was looking at it? the actual date. What There's is a it? bagel. Yes, there is a bagel. Oh, in the yes, yes, exactly. Oh, sure. Exactly. But the Oscars aren't until March 12th, so we still have a lot. We got, we got some just time. Put, oh, yeah. This we got is just time. a big early tease. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations on the noms. Do we want to just give one minute, one minute to just kind of discuss how Tom Cruise was not nominated for uh -oh. a role in which the movie's decent, right? The, the cast around him's fine. What is but this? Top this Gun? Is, Top this Gun. is yeah, Maverick. Maverick. I didn't see it. Top Gun Maverick. It. Oh, you, why didn't yeah. you see it? it? It was for sure worth going to the theater for. It was fun. Tom Cruise alone makes this world real. Mm. Everything is carried on his shoulders. Dude, I know we're like a group of real Tom Cruise lovers here, and you, I, I, so. I talk you know, to He's, other actors, and they like don't quite feel our love of Tom. Mm -hmm. Uh but he is uh, phenomenal, dude. He is yeah. like every movie he's ever done is fucking infinitely better because he's in it. Does Tom have a stinker? Perfect. Like his streak is unreal. He's like a he's like a Bose speaker. In <laughs> movies. Does, does Tom have a Does Tom have a stinker? A bad movie? Does Tom Cruise have a stinker? Yeah, a yeah. film. Yeah, a bad movie. Yeah. I mean, there what has to be one movies? in there somewhere, I but the, the not, seen. not It was the Mummy. The Mummy. The Mummy. Was the <laughs> oh, movie. sure. Right. He took over right. that. Yeah. Brendan Fraser, bro. Wait, he did the Mummy. Yeah, those are big shoes to fill. Who he might lose to? The whale. Oh, the whale. I gotta see that. I gotta watch it. Oh, dude. So, oh, by the way, I was talking with my uh, the orthopedic surgeon, like his like second in charge guy, the like. Mm -hmm. uh, doctor right underneath him mm -hmm. and i was like kind of like bummed that they didn't tell me anything about like my groin and i'm like dude this sucks like i can't work out anymore i can't ride a bike like i feel like i'm just gonna be obese you know and <laughs> and i'm just gonna like morph into this giant blob of a person and he goes dude have you seen the whale Mm -hmm. And I go, uh, no, I haven't seen it I yet. Can't and stop he goes, uh, well, that's awesome because, like, I could see you doing something like that. That'd be like a good uh, piece for you. And I'm like, Whoa. yeah, Thanks. <laughs> I don't know. Right, I'm gonna get my pants back on. Oh wow, really? Yeah. This guy was I on board for you I'm doing unhappy. that, like a, a role like that. Yeah, like, well, and I go, well, you know, Brandon Fraser, Br Br uh, Brendan Fraser hurt his back. And then gained all that weight, like had to quit acting essentially because he hurt his back uh, from doing stunts and stuff. And then oh, he, really? he said no to a bunch of things and then things kind of dried up for him because huh. he kept saying. That's real? I thought he was in a fat suit. He, I think a little bit of it was. Well, he was in a fat suit, but a lot of it is real. He is much, much bigger. Okay. Was he really? So he gained oh like a God. ton of weight from yeah. from having the, these back issues and never getting right. it work. And it was the same thing. It was like he was working too much. He couldn't get it f fixed and worked on. And I'm like, <laughs> and so I told this guy, and he goes, "Yeah, that sounds like you." Like no remorse <laughs> at all. He was He's like, just yeah, not dude. even looking at you. Yeah, yeah like, that yeah, sounds like that sounds like, like what that you're way. going through. <laughs> all right, so uh, <laughs> that's a thousand dollars. That'll be Betty 10 at the grand. Front will take your money. And uh, that's a wheel. <laughs> um, <laughs> All right, guys. Shout out to yep, Rock yep. of Ages, Tom Cruise. I'm oh. going to run that one back. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Shut okay. up. All right. Are you Big, just, but, 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 but two in 40 years. Yeah. There yeah. You go. Living legend, Tom Cruise. Hit. And what? we're not giving him flowers. Nope, not no, at no, all. No, 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 We're no, no, no. Just no. saying he's great. This is We're not just, a flower situation. Just saying he's great. We are absolutely not giving him flowers. No, no, no flowers given. This is more accolades. This is accolades. <laughs> yeah, this is a public accolade. 
<laughs> just love love the guy. Yeah, accolades. Yeah, we don't give flowers anymore. We give accolades. Yeah, mm-hmm. accolades. Yeah, we're giving accolades. Uh, <laughs> Congratulations on the first set of accolades, Mr. Crew. <laughs> <laughs> and that was another episode of... <laughs> 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 